We all knew it was coming, and Yojo June is right around the corner. Let's talk some G.I. Joe Yojo June predictions. As you know, G.I. Joe news has been pretty sparse as of late. As you can see, I haven't done many G.I. Joe videos on the channel in the last month, but that's about to change because Yojo June is where it's at. I threw up a poll on the community page, and I wanted to know what you are most interested in seeing for Yojo June. The first entry was the Stinger, and of course, the moment the G.I. Joe classified vamp was announced, we knew that the Stinger was coming. I've done a video on it, I've done I think a couple videos on it, but the Stinger is definitely a 100% going to be revealed during Yojo June, and that was one of the entries. Next up, we had small vehicle entries, which basically the moment we seen the ferret and the quickly announced Tiger Paw, we knew that more G.I. Joe classified small vehicles were coming, and my vote is the Polar Battle Bear is on its way. Next up, we have our first figure, which is coming off the name only list. We have Alpine. This guy has been much wanted. Like, people really want Alpine, and I'm one of them. I expect him to be revealed during the month of June. Now the fourth entry in the list was the Battle Armored Cobra Commander. Now this guy, I think this guy is high on a lot of people's list and he is high on my list. I really want this guy. We haven't seen a Cobra Commander released in the Classified series in a long time and I'm thinking that's gonna change in a big way. Stay tuned. So according to my market research, it looks like the Battle Armored Cobra Commander is tops on a lot of people's lists. So we'll have to wait and see if he does get revealed in the month of June. Next up, let's talk about retro and some possible figures that we expect to see revealed during Yojo June. First up, we've got that highly anticipated, finally to be released, original carded retro Cobra Commander. This one has been on everyone's list and the people that don't have the Mickey Mouse one from the His Tank are gonna be super excited. This is going to fly off the shelves when it hits the stores. As for a G.I. Joe entry, I totally expect Airborne to be revealed because it's a perfect time to release him with the upcoming release of the Dragonfly. Airborne will indeed fly off the shelves as well. Now let's jump over to the computer and look at some honorable mentions for the retro Carter figures. I think first up, we're going to talk Tripwire. They're going to really want to use this mold again. Um, it's, he's coming for sure. And as well, I think Lowlight is a good candidate to get released. And then lastly, I do think General Hawk is an iconic character that needs to be released in the retro card back because he is amazing. Next up for Yojo June, let's talk name only, and we're gonna do it just like the G.I. Joe team, and we're just gonna give you names. So, first up, I think Hit and Run is gonna come and be announced during Yojo June as well. I think we've seen a lot of Destro's team. Let's get Destro, Gold Destro announced. Then we've always got to have a Cobra Troop Builder to get the blood flown, and I think Night Viper is going to get his turn. Then if we head back over to the computer for some honorable mentions, I do think we will definitely see possibly <laughs> Airtight announced as well. Law and Order. These are two classic G.I. Joe characters that will be announced. And then I do think we will see another Cobra Troop Builder into the form of a Toxo Viper announced. These are some really key characters that I think we'll see added to the pipeline list. Next up, let's talk HasLab. Now, this is a big thing. We are for sure 100% going to see a closer look at the finished Dragonfly product. And as well, I would expect the shipping update to know when we exactly feel that we should get this product. So this leads directly into the next Hazlab product reveal, which I have not been shy that I do think will be the G.I. Joe Snowcat. However, I think we'll get a tease here and then it'll be a further bigger release reveal at San Diego Comic-Con a month later. So that was a lot of predictions and you know what? We'll discuss everything that happens during Yojo June in our next episode of the Everything Transformers, Everything G.I. Joe podcast. Check out the last episode and we'll see you in the next one.